Hello, I'm Chu Chu Chen. I'm going to present monocular visual inertial odometry with planar regularities. Most monocular VIO systems rely on sparse point features to navigate. However, man-made environments provide rich structural information, such as planes, which can be absorbed by a camera for longer period and can benefit long-term navigation. We believe that estimating planes can enable sense understanding and improve AR-VR applications. Constrain 3D features to plane through point-on-plane -plane regularization can further enhance the accuracy and improve the efficiency. In this work, we propose a novel and efficient plane detection and tracking algorithm without the need for any depth sensor or deep network. We have demonstrated that our future-based VIO system with planar regularities is not only efficient but also improves the state-of-the-art point-based VIO. As shown in the figures on the right, we have successfully recovered plane features and rendered a teapot on the plane as a VR demonstration. Additionally, we have open source our code and new dataset to the public. In order to detect and track plane features, we first perform sparse point feature detection use FAST and KLT point feature tracking. This will also provide frame-to-frame -frame plane tracking. To formulate a mesh, we incrementally recover point features to 3D and then formulate a 2D mesh using the Lonnie triangulation and calculate the normal of each triangle. In the top right figure, we show an example of the Lonnie triangulation results and we use colors to represent the value of the normal vectors. The ones share similar colors indicate they are on the same plane. Next, we calculate the normal of each vertex using the connected triangles and reject any invalid vertex to improve robustness. Using the vertex normals, we can more precisely classify each individual point to a plane. Finally, we compare the vertex normals with their neighborhoods to determine if the two points are on the same plane. We also leverage various techniques to robustify this process. Our plane feature detection and tracking algorithm has efficient, accurate, and robust performance. It takes only 3 to 4 milliseconds on the Yorak Mav dataset. Now let's introduce the planar regularities. As the robot moves in the environment and views a point feature PF in G, it can be related to the robot navigation state XC and the feature with the nonlinear camera bearing measurement function. If there are multiple points on a plane, we are able to detect and track plane pi and introduce the plane state. We adopt the closest point representation for the plane. The plane in the global frame G can be represented with its normal direction ng and the smallest distance d between the global frame and the plane. Next, we can formulate a point on plane constraint. This can be understood as projecting the 3D feature vector on the plane normal, and ideally, the distance between point and plane should be zero. This constraint is thus a function of point feature and plane feature, where we could soften this constraint by introducing a small noise term nd. We can formulate the linearized regularity measurements by stacking camera bearing measurement and the point-on-plane -point constraint, where we'll result a linearized measurement equation with respect to the navigation state xc, point feature state pf, and plane feature state pi. H are the measurement Jacobians with respect to these states. To balance the efficiency and accuracy, we also process features as a slam feature and MSCK feature for both point and planes. If features are tracked longer than the sliding window, we insert them into the state vector and perform EKF update to improve accuracy. Short tracked features are thus performing MS EKF update to ensure efficiency. As such, whether the features are in the state or not, the regularity constraint can be efficiently added to the system. From our experiment, the use of SLAM planes shows impressive performance by providing long-term tracking and regularization. We have conducted a comprehensive evaluation of our plane detection and tracking algorithm. As demonstrated in the video, while point features can be easily lose track, our algorithm is able to track planes for longer period of time. We conducted statistical analysis for the tracking algorithm. We show selected results, including the average number of point features per plane, the tracked plane per frame, the average track length for plane feature, and active planes in the state. Our analysis showed that plane feature have a large number of point feature on it and can be tracked for a long time. 
We also note that for the data set with high dynamic motion, such as V103, the low number of coplanar point features can limit the use of sign points. The additional time for plane detection and matching is only around 2 to 4 milliseconds. We also evaluate the performance of our system in both simulation and real-world experiments. Let's first take a look at the simulation results. In the table, we report the RPE and NES values. We show impressive performance gain by introducing slam planes, and the system is able to perform consistent estimation with planar regularities. Moving on to the experiment results on our collected AR table dataset, we demonstrate that incorporating plane features leads to further improvements in VIO accuracy. In addition, our system shows efficient performance and outperforms state-of-the-art plane-based systems. Please check out our open-source code and dataset for more details.